percentage of the game. So hey, Ali comes on for. Uh, looks like Simbongo is the party. And if you recognise the surname, he is the son of Gulam Ali, the owner of Santos, former champions, former winners of this competition in the past. Younger son. successfully at the second attempt, good ball up to uh, Erasmus, and we just hold possession here. Now, possession taken by Highlands, Ani looking to get the return pass. There's Masangu, knocking on the door, suddenly now, Highlands looking to get themselves back in this game, but with uh, just over 10 minutes remaining, it might be all a little bit too late for the Lions of the North. You think they got a chance, William? Yes. This game is its own way of uh, <laughs> testing your faith, but uh, on paper, no, it shouldn't be a big challenge for City to remain uh, the winners. I'm not saying it'll be three nil. Maybe Alex Park can take one at the most two. But it looks obvious at this stage. And uh, with Ludwig, uh, solid in goals. It will tempt me to feel like uh, it's almost like a done deal. But hey, I've said this before and I've had to keep my weight. Given the two suppers you've had tonight, it's uh, enough eating already. <laughs> well, I didn't necessarily have to eat them, I only had to swallow them, so it's not a lot of eating. Now, here's Mokeke. The pick there taking the added responsibility in midfield after Tuchel went off and uh, has come up with the goods. Now oh, that's going to be a free kick for Highlands Park. In a good position. Maybe just to spice it up here in the closing stages if they can get this on target and beat Nuremberg. Well, there's a lot of debating going on there. Peter Shalorina, Ali might take it. Looking for his first top flight goal. The referee, uh, Mr. Mkiza, just giving everybody back the required distance. Coach it quickly, Ali takes it! Nuremberg makes the save. Down the throat of the goalkeeper, it must be said. Well, they've tasted cup success already in this campaign and uh, Cape Town City obviously hungry for more. Well, I've been actually this weekend watching all the rest of the field uh, play. Now here comes Erasmus. So Erasmus! Off target but deflected in a corner. This 
one does the best. You know, it's that, that excellent center of gravity which makes mosquitoes and the ability to twist and turn in small areas. And uh, it really can maintain that just that level of performance. It can be one of the best strikers we have in this country, Erasmus. Timber with his big frame is in there, so he's feeling to get it back into the danger zone. Eventually cleared away by uh, Shalorila, who's back helping out with the defensive work. Here he is again, the Libyan international. Taken away by Rolani. Odisea. Rolani. Running into Mokwena. Mokslafi in the midfield. And then they're turning possession, possession over a little too easily tonight to Ireland's Park. Cup is concerned, it's all over for uh, Ireland's Park and they will uh, now concentrate on the league. Owen the Garner has said repeatedly this season, number one priority just to stay up. But I think they are uh, perhaps worthy of a little more ambition than that now, particularly after that win over Vince. They could probably look for a uh, top eight place. Some nice little skills there from Rolani. And he's won uh, a free kick as well. The, the only uh, thing about the laws of the game, Mark Winston, I think uh, football should have been given a chance as well, just like in boxing, when you feel like your boxer has lost his all, there's no need fighting around, he's losing it. Throw, throw in the towel. Throw in the towel. <laughs> I think... Uh, That's a good point. You're obviously uh, keen to get back to that buffet. <laughs> yeah, I see that. <laughs> Up to and tempo. I'm just thinking, sometimes there's a moment of the game where a coach feels like, okay, this one, 
And you know what invariably happens? Yeah. The referee adds four minutes of stoppage time on at the end. They don't have a sense that they're just rubbing in, the, you know? The anguish for the uh, vanquish. Thank you. 